Just please don't go horse. Go whatever kid except horse. It's Cthulhu. I'm I, I'm gonna go archer. No, hunter. No, there's no levels. Horse ten. These are the options I give myself. Okay. Chill. Uh, the problem I'm getting like fucked up today because I keep trying to make pre-record and suddenly the game is just like, nah, you have a free game crash. Like, damn it, Nvidia, stop crashing. Maybe it's because I had multiple Minecraft versions up, because I, I would just, like, whenever I wanted to join a map that needs 24 players and wasn't very popular, I'd just join it with multiple accounts, because, you know... Oh, that 14% damage, all the coins. You have a stone sword, so I'm going to invite you to a battle, and if you can trade hits with me, you'll kick my ass. Oh, why are you blocking? No. No, now this is personal. Nope. None of that. We got three kills off spawn. Yeah, I'm, it's just the NVIDIA. No, please don't crash. No. I don't know what the problem is. I couldn't even get Forge to work. Whenever I launch, like, any version of Forge, it's 1.7.10. So I guess not any version. But I, I, got, I got, like, three different versions for 1.7.10, and all of them crashed instantly. I'm like, no. It doesn't even wait until the game starts to crash. It's like, launch crash. Don't even get to see the start screen. Oh, man, I don't get a leather helmet. That was a nerf I was going to talk about. It's not even a nerf. It's literally just so you can use Kit Customizer. And to be honest, there are people that... The, the, the best part is that there are actually people that complained. Now, honestly, I thought that the people that would complain were going to be the ones who were like, You didn't nerf it enough! And I'm like, well, it wasn't supposed to be a nerf. But, I mean, I could see why they'd make that complaint. But someone's like, act someone actually was, like, pretty mad that the leather helmet was gone. They're like, why do you take the leather helmet? Horse didn't deserve a... Horse didn't need a nerf. Why did you take the leather helmet? I'm like, honestly, I, I think I think having the kit customizer is more useful than having a leather helmet. I think it was a buff. Because, I, I mean, the horse tamer is that one kit that needs kit customizer the most. It has so many items. And that actually, like, by default comes last or something. It's just, like, no fall damage because we're secretly hackers. On a serious note, though, it's just because it's something something to do with the horse a long time ago. I don't know. But if you dismount off a horse and blit... Oh. Hello. Knock. Bop. Bye. If you dismount off a horse, you're just not going to take fall damage. I just really want the blitz star. You went horse. Is he talking to me? He never said my name. I scrolled up earlier. He didn't ever say my name. Oh, he doesn't even know. Of course I would. It's my level 10. This is a map where you need mobility. Uh, of course my speed runs out right there. <laughs> Boop. And it's as simple as that. Archer... Hey, you went Archer 8. See, if I had the choice to go Archer 8, I honestly would have gone Archer 8. Archer 8 is fucking swag. There we go. Fall Tuncher with a Rory Robin Hood. We could try Robin Hood, but let's be real here. I want to try which one is it? Supplies. It gives you a Flame 1, Infinity 1 bow. It's swag. Protection 3 Diamond Chest Plate, it is. None of those weapons looked that appealing. I don't know, I don't like my Blitz episodes being longer than, say, like, 11 minutes. But it's Cthulhu, so I mean, the game is gonna last 11 minutes, and I aren't recording to be two games. Nope. Don't run. This is your destiny. All of your fear, hope, and ambition was supposed to manifest itself on the end result of, like, 40 coins. He's gonna, he's gonna, have, he's gonna secretly, like, be a rogue. Off the cliff. <laughs> I was so worried he was actually going to end up in the water. That would have sucked. Alright, we traveled half the map. And we finally found a guy. What? What was that last? I don't know. The hits are so hits, sometimes hits are weird. Really. You knock them back, but they get like a bonus hit for some reason. I never really understood it. But that's just a Lego, Lego game PvP. I'm gonna drink a resist. I got a gapple. Got a gapple. This is necessary. Oh. Ah, oh, I was going for the. Okay, you're you're dead. It's it's over. It was that wasn't gonna happen. 
There, there should be like an exception to like the mute where you can type GG because I mean what are how are you gonna be hurtful with the words GG? You're gonna like type out and like morse you're gonna somehow like you know morse code it just like fucking like fuck you do I type in nothing but GG's? It, it's not gonna work. Let's play another game. And we are back playing on Mithril Revive, which isn't popular enough. I I like the oh Andy Valentine is here. That's cool. That's our like I guess that's our pro one v one of the day. I should probably I should just say level ten, but I mean it, it, I just call them pros and they have like three thousand, five thousand wins. I, I mean people are just then people are in the comment section like, well actually they suck in my opinion, and I'm like I don't I don't care. I have played the game more than once probably. Oh no, he's gonna shoot me. He's gonna shoot me. He's gonna do a whole half heart of damage. Oh dang. Oh fuck, it's Andy Valentine with the stone sword. Peace, I'm out. Peace, peace in the least. Holy shit. The amount of crits that. Oh, why is he shooting me? No! <laughs> it's not gonna work. Unless you, like, launch me off a cliff, it's just not gonna happen. You don't have a melee weapon. Your plan was to punch me to death. We have resistance three. Oh hell, that guy has a stone sword as well. Okay. Oh, can I do it? No, are you fucking serious? He got a double hit off of that as well. Nope, you're not gonna win. It's over. Nope. You can only run for so long. Eating and running is bannable. Hey, you're not allowed to eat on the run. It's a very specific rule. There we go. Now we might get jumped. And if that happens, we just gotta eat the gold apple and hope we can like straight line Andy Valentine. Oh, hell, okay, we're gonna hope we can straight line this this fine person. What? What? Submarine and spiders, are you fucking kidding me? Ah, oh, hell no. Peace in the Middle East. Oh, hell no, I didn't get that. Can we combo Andy Valentine? Kind of. Close enough. I'll take it. We did it! Ah! No! That's my gear! Fuck. Ah, son of a bitch. Alright, you guys have a nice fight. Hey! Back off. Nope! Fuck me. Fuck me. He thinks I have the star. That's my one advantage. He thinks I have the star. He does not know that it's still in the chest. And hopefully, he'll stay that way. Nope! I'm in the clear. <laughs> he didn't notice! Yes! He thought I had the star. Why did I do that? I don't know. I'm 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 under stress right now. Okay, I'm under stress. That's my that's my excuse. I I saw protection three and I'm like, oh well, diamond pants. Why would I have diamond pants? See, this this is just it just goes to show. I mean, I I pull off clutch plays like that, fooling them into thinking I have the star, get the star back, and then I instantly fuck it up with the star. Just fucking fight me. I don't care no more. Just want to get stacked. And then get the guy that tried to janitor me earlier. You know, we got level 8. We could get a level 8 enchantment. Maybe on our bow. That'd be interesting, a level 8 enchantment on the bow, because we already got a diamond axe. Don't got a good bow. I'm going to get unbreaking one on this bow. Just, just you fucking wait. <laughs> Please work. You're not cooperating. <gasps> Power one, hell yeah, it didn't fuck up at least. Now we're gonna be ex Nestorio because this guy stole the hell out of our gear. You don't even deserve that gear. Fuck, he's in the trees, he found the weakness. Get the hell out of here, I ain't falling for none of them tricks. No, sir. He just ran while eating, okay. Now I'm really not going to engage this guy in a melee fight. 
I say is I go in for the melee. I can straight line better than you, sir. You are dead. <laughs> and we win. Now, that, that was a good game besides me like completely fucking up with the Blitzstar. This guy's actually pretty stacked. You want diamond pants? Here you go. They're there. Take them. Let's have an awesome fight to the death. Let's go. I'm going to spawn a snowman, though. That, that's the one crutch. Dude, I, I gave you diamond pants. Come on. Come on. Come on. Accept the straight line. You know what's going to happen. What are, what are you doing? I feel bad now. I feel bad. You know what? I don't feel bad. I gave him diamond pants. And GG. And I'm metered again. Okay, so who is the Tim 10? Maybe should, maybe Pike's crafted diamond pants. So many diamonds nowadays. <laughs> they actually got reduced a bit because there's just way too many diamonds. So I told them to reduce it by only a little bit. I mean, there's still diamond swords a lot more than there used to be. That was another episode of the Blitzer Apple Games, guys. That was a roller coaster of just huge successes and then huge failures. I don't know how to treat it. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.